Due to the U.S. congressional delegation's visit to Taiwan, China has suspended all planned discussions with the U.S. on key international issues. The Chinese Communist Party announced on Friday that all discussions about climate change, drug networks, and military action will be cancelled. The decision was attributed to a trip to Taiwan by Nancy Pelosi's congressional delegation. The cancellation also sent a clear signal to the U.S. that the Chinese side will never accept the U.S. blatantly damaging China-U.S. relations without bearing any consequences, said U.S. studies scholar Liu Shang from the Chinese Academy of Social Sciences. In Taiwan, Pelosi praised Taiwan's democratic values and self-government and assured Taiwanese that the U.S. would maintain regional security interests. Taiwan and the Taiwan Strait, the relatively narrow stretch of ocean that separates Taiwan from the Chinese mainland, have long been claimed by the People's Republic of China. Aircraft from the Chinese military have frequently flown into the area, testing Taiwan's air defenses. The U.S. does not have official relations with Taiwan. Also known as the Republic of China, and maintains a one China policy that recognizes the People's Republic of China as the legitimate successor nation. CCP officials remain irked despite repeated attempts by the White House to calm the escalating hostility surrounding Pelosi's visit, trying to smooth over the recent congressional delegation to Taiwan. Secretary of State Antony Blinken spoke with reporters Thursday. As reporters were escorted out of the conference room to allow the two leaders a moment of closed-door discussion, Blinken briefly touched on a related issue. I want to speak to the recent activity concerning Taiwan because I know it's on a lot of people's minds, Blinken said. The United States continues to have an abiding interest in peace and stability across the Taiwan Strait. We oppose any unilateral efforts to change the status quo, especially by force.